Hey, hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough! That was probably my fastest intro that I've ever said ever. Now what I'm going to be doing in this part is checking on what the heck that switch opened and I believe it was a door somewhere nearby. <laughs> I don't recall which door I opened with that switch though. So that may be a thing... Oh, what, in here maybe? Was it this thing? <laughs> Whoa! Hello! Wait, what? Is, what are these things roaming around? Uh, no, I mistimed my thing. That is a normal Skulltula, and I hear a gold Skulltula owl roaming around this room. Perhaps I should have gotten a shield. <laughs> Something tells me that I can't... Oh, wait, wait, maybe? Maybe, just maybe. Because I can see a Skulltula twitching. Uh-oh, uh-oh. No infinite loop, please. Wait, what was that? Was that a Skulltula? Um, I don't know. <laughs> but I'm, I'm getting my butt handed to me. Ow. Uh, pull this back, pull this back. Oh, that's a keys. That explains it. Okay, let's pull this back if I can. Or not. Maybe I... Oh, I did pull it back. Yeah, yeah, Wah! Must kill Skulltula. <laughs> there we go, I got a token, yay! Now, I think I'm capable of taking care of this room um, without the Lens of Truth, just maybe. Ow. There we go. I, I just had to listen for the sound of that Skulltula, basically, and wow, thanks for the hearts, man. Okay. Keys? That's just sing slingshot? Is there any reward to doing this? Besides that Skulltula? Well, granted the Skulltula is necessary for our 100% run here. But I'm not seeing any reward, unless it's invisible because this was a Lens of Truth room? Because I definitely needed the Lens of Truth there to get through that room without taking much damage. Or, well, or at least I would think I would. Wait, don't I need to hit these things? Oh, never mind. I, th I thought I had to hit some of those things. Anyway, um, let's explore this place a, a tad more, I suppose. Well, there's this place that I can climb through here. So, well, I should say crawl through here, wherever the heck this takes me. This takes me to a completely dead-end room. What? I, I see something... Is that a little... Is that a switch poking out of the eye? I have to admit, I had a good eye on that one. Ha ha ha! Oh, never mind. <laughs> oh, great, we got floor masters and wall masters now. Because we got this critter right here. No! I don't think so. But I want to take care of the one that warps me out of the room first. You! You have got to go. Not you, Greenie. You! <laughs> now I'm going to take care of you, and hopefully take care of you in this corner, so I will be able to get your babies when you spawn them really quickly. Uh, 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 yeah. wait, wait, no, please do not respawn. Thank you! And... What? I don't have a key! Blasphemy! No! Well, I guess I gotta be back here later. Man, they definitely souped up the difficulty of the uh, bottom of the well, that's for sure. <laughs> so, remember that cr crawl space down here for later. And for now, we just gotta explore, I suppose. I really hope I don't have to bomb, like, a hole in the floor or something like that. That really feels like something that I'm gonna have to do a little bit later. Um... I bet you that le I bet you that keyhole, or I should say that door leads to, or I should say that's where that locked door led to. Excuse me. Um, this is another one of those spooky cult rooms. Ooh, fairy! Oh, please tell me I can get this fairy. Not like that other time where it kept evading me. Oh, yeah, there we go. That fairy trolled me hard. That other one back in the Dongo's cavern. Um, now there's a thing I blew up. 
early in the dungeon, way at the beginning, if you recall, um, there was like a hole, this right here. So I'm gonna check down here, I suppose. Um, nothing! <laughs> Absolutely nothing! But as you can see, there's four other holes. So does that mean that this counts as a different floor as well? Yes, it does. Okay, so I, I can go down here. Wait, is this is this taking me out of the dungeon? I hope this isn't taking me out of the dungeon. I have a very bad sense of direction. Yeah, this is... Wait, is it? No, wait, 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 wait. I don't recall there being a door to the dungeon when I entered. So I think this is new. I think this is new. I just might be in that bottom right corner of the big square there. See that boxed in area there? Uh oh. Oh! This enemy. Oh, this is uh, the boss of the bottom of the well here. It's known as Dead Hand and is probably the creepiest enemy in the entire game. Let one of these hands grab you. Ugh! Shake it free, shake it free, shake it free. And Dead Hand here will expose it himself like that. And look at this sucker. It's one of the freakiest freakiest zombie things I've ever seen. And if you don't let it grab, ow. If you don't let one of these hands grab you, it won't pop out of the ground. Uh, so you just gotta let it grab you and then let it come close. Ah, there we go. No, 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 freaking Jesus. Ow. <laughs> Now, put your head back down. No. I hate those things. Come on, head back down, please. I would appreciate it. There we go. Its weakness is its head, and that's why I wanted to put its head down. There we go. And I believe that puff of sm dirt or whatever. Ow, yeah, it does hurt you. <laughs> Come on, pop out of here. It's coming from way on the other corner for whatever reason. Giving me ample time to shake myself free. And Z targets you for the win. And look, just look how it moves. It like shakes as it moves. It's just so creepy. And the disembodied, well not disembodied, they're like super long. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Super long like tentacle hands of, ugh. And it's dead. Well, if you can kill a zombie, so to speak. Opens the door. Give me a key or something or a compass. I don't know. I bet you this is the compass, not the, um, um, item, dungeon item, because I'm pretty sure the dungeon item's in the basement. La 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 la! Happy days! Okay, I seen some stuff that I can make explode, and I believe keys are actually hidden under these things. Just like this. <laughs> That's why I've been blowing these things up for a while, because I'm, I've been trying to find a key and I just wanted to surprise you basically <laughs> and all right now I can go back over to that locked door room or, or at least I think that's my next destination that I'm supposed to be going maybe because that other room was a dead end so I can't really get any further there and I don't think this opens I believe that's just a little vent detail for uh, where the water drains out basically Oh, now that I got the map and compass, I can actually take a look around here and see what I'm missing. See, that? that's where the, the um, Lens of Truth is. That treasure chest right there on basement three. Okay, so there's two rooms that I haven't been in yet at the bottom of the well. Oh, key dokey. So there's this one over here, which is locked. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I can get through here. Okay, so so there's probably two keys that I have to find by blowing up these piles of whatever here <laughs> to progress through this place, I think, maybe. Should I bother going through here first or should I go through? Uh, I'm going to end up exploring this entire dungeon anyway, so let's just go through here right away. Oh my god, mummies. Oh, they're just like reed dads, except they are even more resilient, basically. No, no, I would like to... I want to scan it with Navi to see what she had to say about it for fun. And I believe they're also a little bit more um, aggressive, but they're still weak to the uh, Sun Song. So let's just uh, do, 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 do. There we go. And then I'll get behind it and start slashing like crazy. Yep. 
And yeah, they take a load of hits. Oh, okay, maybe not any more than a typical redo. <laughs> I assume I'm gonna have to light some torches in here with my Deku sticks. There's a pole. Mm, yeah. Yeah, I didn't think that would work. I couldn't get it off fast. Wait. Skultula, what are you doing here? Ow. Wait, 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 wait. Is that the third Skultula I got out of this place? Because I'm pretty sure there's only... Yeah, there's only three in this area. Yes! Skultulas are 100%ed! I feel accomplished! And now I must kill you. Otherwise, you'll probably get in my way as I'm trying to light torches. <laughs> eh, eh. Please, let me destroy you. Mm. Eh, fine. <laughs> um, mm, there we go. Now, how do I want to light these things? Oops. Hopefully in, in no... Oh! I guess it doesn't matter how I light them. Oh! What the... Oh, poopers. <laughs> uh, so these only open the... Uh, uh, coffins here. Okay. I'm gonna save a stick here. Uh, one of these has to contain... Oof, I didn't mean to do that. One of these has to contain a lovely prize for me. Otherwise, I don't see the point of opening these things. <laughs> uh, another mummy. I bet you it's invisible or something, whatever's in these chests, or pff, chests, these coffins here. No, 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 no. You are going to get stun songed. <laughs> da, 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 da. And I just noticed I'm running low on battery power on the camera that records the game system, so I'm going to have to watch this carefully. That would really, really, really suck if I lost some footage. Yeah, you get the idea. Wait, let me climb inside the thing. Because there might actually be something invisible in one of these things that I might need. <laughs> yeah. Or maybe, I don't know. Must kill! It must kill! Kill before it humps me to death! Yeah. Yeah. No! Stop humping! <laughs> what? Jesus! No, how did it? How did I get away from it as it was jumping onto me to hump me? I have no idea. Well, there's apparently a heart inside the coffin here, which doesn't really make much sense considering that it is a place of death. <laughs> um. Um. No, let me let me hop in, please. E no. Uh, you can't get in there here, can you? Wait, here, let's try something fun here. Can you grab me when you're right next to the edge? No, you can't! I am invulnerable! <laughs> Why didn't I ever think of that before? You can stun me all you want to, man, but it isn't, isn't going to make any difference whatsoever. <laughs> now that I killed everything in the room, does that do anything? I don't think so. Was this just simply a room to get that Skulltula? Because I find that hard to believe, because this room made me go through a lot of trouble to kill all these things. Unless I'm missing something, like maybe these odd, whatever, flying critter statues, maybe they're key sculptures or something like that. I don't know, I just find it hard to believe that this room would have absolutely nothing in it besides that Skulltula. Hmm. I mean, maybe it does. <laughs> I wouldn't put it past the uh, Master Quest. I mean, there was a couple dead ends in this game that had only a Skulltula, so... Alright, I guess I gotta go look for another key. Apparently. <laughs> because I used up the key for that room, but I needed to, to at least get that Skulltula, so... There's probably another key in another pile of dirty trash or whatever the heck that I'm blowing up with bombs. So, what about this thing right here? Does this have... Nah, I, I was just looking in the mouth to see if there's like anything. Well, what, 
maps. What does my map say about rooms I haven't visited? Well, there's a couple rooms in the center that I didn't visit yet. So there is this one on this side as well. Oh my. <laughs> it's invisible stuff. Will I be able to do this without the lens of truth? Will I? Do I just have to follow the pots? Is that what the pots are for? I believe that's what the pots are for. There's a key! Yeah, baby! And I didn't see any other locked doors, so... For all I know, that is uh, the last key in the dungeon. And I got all the Skulltulas, so... Wait, can I blow this up? I don't think I can blow this up, per se. I didn't think so, okay. So, the locked door was... I should say the crawl space to the locked door was over here. There we go. And... Eh. Oh yeah, I gotta shoot that thing again. Because those switches don't stay pressed. Well, this particular switch doesn't stay pressed. And... I think I'm actually gonna leave that door for the next part. Because I'm at 16 minutes now. I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you in the next part.